Oh man! Here we go at it again. <laughs> Pain for days. This is the beginning of the long painting journey that I had. Um, we got this gripper primer that we uh, researched about and saw that other people were using because um, a lot of the surfaces, like we're painting on all these vinyl um, surfaces and on the wallpapered walls, so we needed to get a good primer that would have that, a that lot the, of coverage. Yeah, and, that the paint stick. And let the paint actually stick and not kind of melt off in the floor to heat. <laughs> <laughs> um, so we took pretty much our whole house and, and just laid the doors out and yeah, the whole house. got to work. And the process took quite a while. It took, you know... A week or two to get Especially all this done. because I did most of the painting by myself. Yeah, most of the painting by herself. Because I was Christian doing, did all the other projects. I was, I was hanging out on the couch watching. So, so painting was <laughs> painting was my my deal. Um, the gripper paint was very primer was very thick, and so like rolling it on was like my arm was sore because it's not like easy like just rolling paint on like it would stick. But like so, a good foundation. Yeah. Like me yeah. and you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we got a little trailer update. Primed everything. Getting into these cabinets was a lot of fun, as you can see. Do it too. Best job in there, but it'll do. Everything all primed. Gonna start painting today. Wait, 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 wait. It already feels so much cleaner in here, just getting all the primer on the wall. Christian put these wall, this wall back up into our bathroom. We have a new vanity, it's in here. Alright, Christian's going to go get this stuff to put this wall up today. Our vanity's going to go right here. There's our toilet. And then our shower. Christian also sealed up the floor yesterday with all this silicone. Here's our new vanity bathroom sink. A lot better since the last one was plastic. <laughs> and it was like a quarter of the size of this. And so yeah, all this, this will go in today. This wall, this wall, I have to paint both of those, yay. And then I need to repaint because he put in these panels, coat, sealing up these holes. So I need to repaint this wall. I, need to, I never did a second coat on it anyway because he's got a little repairs he's got to do to it. So I'm always waiting for him to finish that. So hopefully I can, wishful thinking, I'm going to finish painting. Okay. Wishful thinking. And then uh, we can get the floors in this week and uh, then do some fun stuff like wallpaper and backsplash. We're doing a backsplash all, all under here. So that's why I didn't even really bother with the second coat of primer. We just painted over the border because we didn't see any way to get it off. And then <laughs> yesterday it was a really hot day. And Christian was able to just pull some of it off in the bathroom. But I think it's because it was just really hot and humid. But there we go. That's it for now. Alright, so after a long hard day painting yesterday, I still have a little bit more to do. <laughs> but we got all the gray done on all the walls. And we got majority of the cabinet work done. I just want to do like a little bit more inside the cabinets and just like a little bit of touch ups and stuff. But most of it is all done. And it just feels so much cleaner in here with all the light. We're going to eventually put new countertops in and put in. I painted back here gray. But I am going to do like a, one of the sticky tile backsplash as soon as I find one that I like. We have all the door cabinet doors are all completely done and painted. Um, up here I just need to do a little bit more work along the edge, the trim. And maybe a little bit more attention inside the cabinets. 
it's really hard to get inside all these cabinets. And this one is an open cabinet, so I want to try to do the best I can in there. Um, to touch up a little bit underneath here, do another coat and paint along the wall. I really like the gray color we ended up choosing. It looks good with the white, I think, nice and light, but it's what I wanted. And our floors are called Ashen Oak, and so they have a little bit of uh, gray to them. So I think it'll look good with it. This cabinet turned out pretty good. I still have to do, like, mostly just edge work around is what I have to do. Getting inside that cabinet was fun, too. <clears throat> well, the gray turned out really nice. We're going to do a whole bunch of trim work around everywhere. So it'll look like a lot more finished. Painted. I painted the entire day yesterday from like 10 in the morning till 10.30 at night. This is a wall we're going to keep like this, but we're probably going to stain it a color. Um, this is the bathroom. So... And then as, after we put floors in, Christian's going to put the vanity in. We brought a new one because it had um, this like little vanity with this tiny little plastic sink. So we just went and bought a new vanity. It was like $70 um, from Home Depot. So definitely worth it. Here's our awesome new shower that Christian put in. We have some more doors in here into our bedroom. So I need to do, I know I need to hold, do a whole, at least one more coat on that cabinet right there. I did one coat inside these cabinets, so I need to do another coat for sure. But I painted the outside last night, I was just got so tired and I didn't want to get in there. I did a, a two coats inside this cabinet, but it probably needs another one. And then just a lot of edge work too. I didn't want to tape up the gray last night and... You know, we're just pulling it off the wall, so I kind of just stayed away from the edges. And we bought like one of those edger things, but I wasn't too good with it. And then again, Christian put these new walls. We actually ended up making the bathroom a little bit smaller. I mean, just like a couple inches. We took a couple cabinets out because we wanted to have a different shower. And so Christian built new walls, and he bought this wood. And it's kind of cool. We think we're probably just going to stain it. It's a little different. I like it. Pick out a nice stain for it. Um, we're also getting, we're gonna put uh, wood over top these things around the slide. There's another one that goes on the other side that we had taken off. Just like a thin piece of wood and we'll probably end up staining it like the same color that we end up staining those walls. But majority of the painting is finished. Just a little bit of touch that's left and I cannot be happier about that because my whole body aches from trying to get into all of the cabinets. And I never really want to paint ever again. <laughs> but very happy with how it's turning out. And uh, next stop is really uh, cleaning it up and putting floors in. So, here we go. Looking back on this gives me nightmares. <laughs> 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 Thinking about how, how like, because, you know, getting into all the crevices, like, all the cabinets and everything was so much work. <laughs> yeah, I had, to, I had to jump in and give her a hand that last, that last run. Yeah, because I was, like... When we get into that gray. Yeah. Because it was just, well, I, it was just way too much to yeah. do for one person well, in the time frame that we had to do it in. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so. And the paint, the actual paint was much easier to apply than the primer was. Yeah, and I, w I was still trying to get things together, uh, you know, for certain places that need to be painted that weren't even installed yet. So we were, we were kind of running around. We were kind of going a little crazy at this point. This is when the project started to be not as fun <laughs> as, oh, I, yeah, as it started our, out We as. had our days and we were just so done with it. Yeah, yeah. Especially since we did it in such a short amount of time. Um, but... Yeah, and you can see we're you know we're starting to get you know the cabinets back on and you know their stuff just was everywhere all over the place and we were trying so hard to keep it organized. I think but, once we put the cabinets yeah, back on, it was like yeah, once, it started to feel really good. Yeah, once the doors got back on better. and stuff like that, it was a lot easier for us to even move around and get things done. Yeah, and then you get more of the fun stuff, putting yeah. in the floors and 
everything. And, and it really just it started to feel like you were actually getting something done at this point. So uh, it was a, it was a good time to see it all coming together. Stay tuned for part four, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.